Welcome back to the fish room and the plan for today is making uh, two aquariums for my new Neocaridina shrimps that I'm planning to sell and the first one is located here another one is in the different part of the fish room they are exactly the same dimensions 45 centimeters long and the volume is 30 liters uh, as I said, uh, I will stock it with uh, Neocaridina shrimps, two different species. First is blue jelly and the second is uh, white pearl. So what we need to do next is just add a thin layer of foam below the aquarium and the black background. And after this we can continue with uh, scaping uh, the aquarium adding the soil, plants and all the other things. So let's go. layer of the soil that was added is a very thin one it's only one centimeter so I added uh, two liters of tropical soil it's uh, one liter inside this aquarium and another liter in the other aquarium uh, I prefer the black color because the colors of the shrimp I'm planning to add are blue and white and they will pop even more on the black uh, soil and with the black background.
aquarium is finally completed as you can see I added some moss on the ceramic pads and uh, it will grow in a couple of weeks also I added uh, some leaves other cones and small bricks and the main purpose is for it to grow biofilm which will be a food source for the young shrimplets what remains now is uh, just to wait for the aquarium to cycle and then in a couple of weeks we can add the shrimps four weeks later finally both of the aquariums are ready they are cycled in the beginning I added some uh, mini ram's horn snail, snails to cycle it faster and now after checking all the parameters I can uh, finally add the shrimps first to go in will be white pearl shrimps and then later on I will add the uh, blue jelly shrimps This is a blue jelly aquarium exactly one month later. There's a lot of new shrimps. This uh, green leaf is the grape wine leaf that I took from my garden. I boiled it for three minutes and then I dropped it in. This was two days ago. As you can see they ate everything. And there's a lot of new shrimps approximately 50 to 70 of them I've been keeping uh, light for 14 hours a day I'm trying to develop more biofilm and algae especially there on the sides of aquarium and on the back glass also on the leaves and on the substrate the biofilm will help uh, young shrimplets to survive and to support a greater number of shrimps in this small aquarium. And there is one buried female there, you can see her. She's carrying eggs. Moss is growing fine as well as Lobelia cardinalis as I said this is only the blue jelly aquarium 
white pearl aquarium is exactly the same so I'm not going to show it it looks exactly the same only with white pearl shrimps and that's it for this video in the next one we will continue making more breeding setups so see you in the next one